This is the most glam I've ever been to Nando's. Like I feel like I don't look very nice. I feel a bit podgy. The judgy bloke to my right, he's wonderful. I actually cried. He cried his eyes out. Wait there, hold on. Yeah, the woman said something to the husband and then the husband looks over. It makes me feel so insecure. I think the whole restaurant looks. The whole restaurant. Hello, honey. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're just joining me now, then hi, my name is Imogen. I'm so excited for this video. Today, I am going to be doing a very exciting video. I wanted to branch out and break insecurities and stereotypes for 2020. I am trying to make videos which all have a purpose, which all try and send a message to you guys. So, for this video, as the title suggests, I'm going to be going in full glam to Nando's. Heels, full on makeup, and a very exciting outfit. And then, on the flip side, I'm going to be going to the Ivy, one of the most beautiful restaurants, I think, in very, very underdressed clothes, no makeup, and not brushing my hair. I know that you might be thinking, why are you doing this? I'm doing this for everyone out there who feels like they have to conform to a specific stereotype. I know I've done it in the past, and it's not from other people's judgments, it's our own insecurities. I've gone to places and feel like I feel underdressed and everyone's staring at me, even if they're not. I wanted to find out today if they are actually staring at me. So I'm going to be getting very underdressed and going to the Ivy and then I'm going to be getting very overdressed and going to Nando's and we're going to see if people judge me. We're going to be seeing how I actually feel with putting this experiment to the test. I want to do this for you guys and I want to do this for myself, for my younger self because when I was younger I was so insecure and so worried about judgment I would never have done anything like this and ever broken out of my comfort zone. But today I really am going out of my comfort zone to prove to myself and to prove to you guys that you can wear, be whoever and whatever you want to be. So so let's do this. 2020, I'm coming for you. Also, my outfits are going to be from Just Fab. You can see in the description, and they're going to be sick. I can't wait to show you. Also, makeup. Stay tuned for later. <laughs> Hit the subscribe button and enjoy my family puns. Okay, bye. Sorry. 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 So, hello, beautiful angels. This is the first outfit i've got my lovely little fleecy puffer it's cropped and then i've got some leggings on some nice comfy stretchy leggings i've also got some nice little trainers to go with it as well so last night just a bit of a backstory i have done loads of videos on it i actually have a stomach condition last night i was up till about five o'clock in the morning in absolute agony so i've had about three hours sleep i probably look really tired i feel like i look really tired i'm extremely bloated because i'm constipated Sorry for the awful too much information. But this is quite a big deal for me today to be going out in this. These leggings are quite tight, which I love normally. However, when I feel bloated, I don't feel that comfortable today in my body. I really don't. So this is gonna be quite a big thing for me. I feel like I look tired, run down. I don't feel myself. When I haven't slept, anyone that doesn't sleep sometimes can understand where I'm coming from. You feel low in yourself and I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. Today, I don't feel great but I'm positive that I can get over this and I can overcome it by putting myself out of my comfort zone. So today, that is what I'm doing. We're going to yoga first, so I'm going to be sweaty. I'm gonna be a hot, sweaty mess. Hopefully it'll give me a little bit of a flush to my cheeks. And then after yoga, I'm going to the Ivy in this outfit. I really hope they let me in because I don't know what their dress policy is like, but hopefully they'll let me in because it's lunchtime. But I just wanted to show you guys, you can do whatever you want, wear whatever you want, be whoever you wanna be, especially on those days where you don't feel yourself. Try and put yourself out of your comfort zone and I promise you, you will reap the rewards. We've got this, come with me, help me. I feel like I've got my best friends with me when you come with me, so let's go. Let's do this, let's do this. Hello beautiful angels, so we have just finished yoga. Yes we have. I'm in my outfit right here, got the trainees on, you know it, trainees, you know what I mean? I'm really excited, we are now going to the Ivy. Yoga was amazing, first time properly doing it and we smashed You're it. so good as well. My hair looks, so are you, my hair looks awful, I'm sweating. I stink, but let's go to the Ivy. I'm hoping they let us in. Spencer's bought jeans because he's not going to be dressed like me. But I'm excited. I'm excited to push myself out of my comfort zone, go to a place where I feel like I'm going to get judged. That's probably my own insecurity, but I'm going to go there. I'm going to wear no makeup. I'm going to not brush my hair. I'm going to wear my leggings. I'm going to wear my sweaty mess clothes, and we're going to go and eat at the Ivy. Yeah, I'm going <laughs> for lunch because that was very hard yoga. Yeah, it was good. Too many downward dogs. <laughs> this is quite a big thing for me as well because I do have a stomach condition where I bloat a lot. Right now, I don't feel very comfortable being in leggings. I don't feel very comfortable not having makeup on because I haven't slept. And I know that I'm very much like, let's all be positive and let's 
be, you know, going out and being less insecure, but I'm not gonna lie to you, I feel insecure today. Like I feel like I don't look very nice, I feel a bit podgy, oh, and that's, amazing. thank you, I love you, but you know some days you wake up and you just feel insecure and you feel like, oh God, what if I see my subscribers, they're probably gonna think I'm a catfish, but that's in my own head, and by doing things like this and going to the Ivy and wearing clothes I don't feel very comfortable in today, or even though they're nice, you know, when you just feel uncomfortable, and wearing no makeup and not having my hair done, it's gonna make me feel better because I'll feel positive because I'll be like, I did it. Yeah, I didn't think I could do it. This. Yeah, like I didn't think I could do it, but I did it. And I know that sounds silly, it's such a small, minute thing, but for me, that's a big thing. When I couldn't wear makeup in public when I was younger, I used to try and go out in, with no makeup and I'd feel so insecure I'd never do it. For me now, this is proving to myself that I can do anything I think I can't do. And I'll go home today and I'll feel so positive and happy and be really proud of myself that I did something that I didn't think I could. And you can all do this. You can all do this. Female Everyone, empowerment. Let's exactly. do this. Exactly. And it's not just this. It's something else that you might think you can't do. You can do. Like, we all have those yeah, days where we're like, oh, I look ugly. I look fat. Everyone feels like that. And today, I'm making myself feel more confident by tackling this. Yes. So here we go. Ivy, this. we're coming. Here we go. Oh my God, everyone's dressed up. And there's Imogen. Oh no, what if they don't let us in? <laughs> yeah, I love my photo. Here we go, then. Come on. To show everyone that you can do it. I look awful. Oh, no, you don't. Let's do this. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like people are already looking at my trainers, already looking me up and down, but it's in my own head. Here we go then, Hans. We're going through the ivy. In suits. Yeah. Look at this. We're probably sat aboard everyone, so yeah. Let's do this. Sat... Oh, so nice. Lovely outfits. <laughs> Of all the places that we could get put, we're sat in the business section. Everyone is either corporate, corporate yes. Oh well, we're here, we're doing it, we're loving life. There isn't anyone dressed like me, but that's fine. Oh, the music's starting. Yeah, there's a judgy bloke to my right. He's wonderful. He's lovely. He's like, why are you here? Because you're wearing trainers. I think you love the trainers, eh? I think you like the trainers. They're from Just Fab, if you want to know one. If you want to know. I don't like judgy people. I mean, maybe he's just set in his ways. You know, some people just have their own set ways, and that's fine. I'm not going to judge him for being judgy. I don't rate that he's judgy. Can I just say, I think my wife is an absolute boss. Like, she may come across as this real confident person, but really, deep down, she's not. So, I think she's amazing coming in here, just like that. Massive respect. Here we go, loving life. There we go, loving life. We've got a little judgmental situation in front of me. Am I zoomed in? I think I might be. I'm zoomed in. Just, um, Spencer actually caught it. It was just a little sort of, um, what are what you I doing wearing what you're wearing? What Not I the no makeup, it was the trainers. What, the trainers. I, what I find really sad is normally the woman that says something to the man. Yeah, so. the woman to her husband and then the husband looks over it makes me feel so insecure because I'm like what are you staring at me for you know uh, women should be backing women like they should be like fair play she is she should be standing together in this situation yeah. exactly I, I, do you know what I really want to push female empowerment I really I do I love that yeah, I, maybe I, in a past life you were I think that's <laughs> <laughs> so that was actually amazing the food was lovely, everyone was really fine. There was a couple of judgmental people and we were sectioned right in front of them and beside them, to the left of them, up in front of them, but it's fine. I Listen. feel confident, I feel so much better than when I went in there, sorry baby. I feel so much better and more like, like confident. I felt so That's insecure good. going in there, I felt really, really yeah. like lethargic, rubbish, but I feel so Universal positive and confident. Professionals educated. Yeah, he yeah, loves it, he loves he's it. He's again. trying to plug it, he's trying to plug what he's doing, I love that. But I feel so much better and I feel so empowered. I want to empower you guys to do whatever you think you can't do. Like, I know it sounds silly, but I was having a down day. I was having a really insecure day. I went in there, I've come out, I feel like I can attack the world. I'm ready for tonight, I'm ready for full glam, I'm ready for Nando's in a very over the top makeup look and outfit. But I'm buzzing, I'm so excited, I feel so proud and happy and I couldn't have done it without you. Yeah, first with the business people, we're corporate as well. We're <laughs> having our business.
<laughs> me and exactly me and my trainers you know a lot of you might be watching this being like that's not a big deal that's nothing i do it every day and that's fair well done to my hunts but coming from a girl that was really insecure when she was younger i would never have done that when i was younger i was so insecure of not wearing makeup and i was so 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 unconfident that to me this is a massive deal that i do this now the fact that i go to cinema on my own was a massive deal to me and i think that you might feel really confident every single day or there might be some days you don't feel confident but there are loads of people watching that don't have the confidence to go out with any makeup on or don't have the confidence to go out in underdressed clothes and feel like they can have the confidence to go to places they want to go to and I'm doing this for them and I'm also doing it for me for my younger self because I feel like if we empower each other Hello, baby. If we empower each other, then we can get through this. And I know that some people are watching this and they're thinking, I could never do that. You could. You could. You are beautiful with and without makeup, angels. And you deserve to wear whatever clothes you want, to wear whatever makeup you want. And tonight is another test of that. So, angels, I'm in my next outfit. Slightly different vibe we're going for. We are going full glam. My eye makeup, I think, is absolutely popping. I matched it to my outfit. I'm very excited to wear this outfit. This is a beautiful pink two-piece with a blazer and lovely fitted trousers. I got them in a size eight, both of them, and we've got these gorgeous heels. I've got to show you. I'm absolutely obsessed. Sorry. Sorry, what? So I'm going to Nando's dressed like this. I'm a boss baby princess and I'm about to work the floor in Nando's. I'm so excited slash a little bit apprehensive because this is the most glam I've ever been to Nando's. I'm here for it. I'm not that nervous because I've had a confidence boost from today. I also don't think I've spoken enough about Just Fab. They're actually an amazing brand. They're from Los Angeles and they cater all sizes, shapes, occasions, whatever you need, baby honeys. Just Fab have got it. Oh, that was my bra, that's fine. It's fine. I love the outfit. Also, right now, I'm not excited because I took my shoes off, but you can get any pair of shoes for £10 if you go and click the link in my description box. It's an amazing VIP program. You know the drill. You've got it. Go check the description. Love your life. If you buy any pair of shoes for £10, you automatically get signed up for the VIP program, which we love to be a VIP. You actually don't have any obligation to buy anything, and you can also skip a month if you're not really interested in buying anything that month, etc. But if you do skip the month, you still get all the perks, and they are some good perks. Baby Princess is a VIP. Don't worry about me. So you get better pricing for the VIPs, you get exclusive deals, free delivery on orders over £35, free exchanges, what more do you want? Also, Huns, what I really like about it is they give you a little quiz and then they give you your own little boutique shop to shop from, from the quiz. Anyway, go and shop in the description my outfits if you like them. There you go. Look at oh, you. Oh, thank you. This is Horton. Is that my makeup? We just call it Glam Nose, shall Glam we? Glam Nose! You, Let's go! I'm... I chucked on a shirt that oh, I dressed nice. up, eh? I bet you've been thinking about Glam Nose for ages. No, I haven't actually. Oh, I on love the spot. Witty man! Witty man. So, Angels, sorry if the lighting's really bad, but we are currently sitting outside Nando's. I'm ready to go in. There was a tiny bit of nerves, and now I'm like, no, I'm about to strut my stuff in Nando's. Love my little life. Sit there with beat makeup on like thank you very I'm much real mills. baby prince the light's gone it doesn't even matter let's go to nandino's there you go. let's go that. to nanzo spotlight's on you Whee! i think everyone's gonna think wow god she's overdressed for nando's they're gonna be like she's wearing heels to nando's she all right because nando's is basically like a i would say fast food takeaway but still really nice and it's a busy one and it's a small one and there's people already staring yeah. so we're in nando's it was a spin oh Look at your outfit, lovely outfit. A lot of people looking at her. But she is clammed up to the night. Oh. Whole table of lads. Thank you. <laughs> you look so nice. What? I think the whole restaurant looks. Whole restaurant. Is yeah, I know. If everyone listens, they'll be able to hear the chat behind. Oh, I know. Outrageous. Amazing. Let's do this. Whatever. Exhibit A, the lads behind. They actually laughed at me, didn't they? Me? No, not you. <laughs> idiot. The men can be so intimidating. Like, they're being worthy and not very nice, but also judgmental at the same time. I can feel Spencer feels uncomfortable as well, because they just keep staring around. Like, I don't know whether they're being judgmental or just being pervy. But either way, I'm sitting here with my husband, like, kissing him. Like, they shouldn't really be staring. Do you know what I mean? I get it. Like, they're looking at me because of my makeup and my hair and stuff and my outfit. But also, like, you don't have to keep staring around when I'm with my husband because it can make him feel uncomfortable. Do you know what I mean? 
problem. Anyway, I thought early was going to be worse than the Ivy, but I think this one's actually harder. Because <laughs> everyone's in jeans and trainers and joggers and there's me like, chilling. Just me, chilling, getting ketchup and drink. I feel like everyone is directly behind me. This station is literally like in the centre of Nando's and I'm like, getting a drink. Taking this. I honestly can't imagine how many people are so scary. Like, I think the men are being really out of order to Spencer. I think they're making him feel really uncomfortable, like between you and I. He'll probably tell you later, like, he feels intimidated and is not buzzing about it. But anyway, I'm loving my life in my uh, little pink attire. Awful lighting. I look horrendous. But I feel confident. I'm not even embarrassed. I was wondering if I still had the labels left on, but I don't. So it's fine. Just having a chat with Mills, and like, it's intimidating for her, but. Even for a bloke, it's intimidating. Like you just want to go for a bite to eat with your wife, with your girlfriend, and, like, and blokes, they have no respect these days. They just think that they can look at what is yours, and it is absolutely ridiculous. Because I think it's what I'm wearing. It's out of order. Yeah, but you're, what you're wearing is unreal. I love I, you. I, I was thinking when you're getting your, your drink, you look so nice. I love like, you. Thank you. So yeah, to all the lads out there who feel intimidated by other blokes because their lack of respect. I feel you. And don't worry, lads, because you are going home with your girl at the end of the night. Yeah, give me a big kiss. Give me a Thumbs big up kiss. to them. Come on then, give me a kiss. I feel more bad for you because I feel like you have to come to these places and everyone stares at me and you're the one that has to deal with me like, oh, she's in her pajamas or she's got, uh, you know, do you know what I mean? Don't bother me, no, Mouse. Thank you. Well, I love you and I'm hungry. Are you? I think you've completed this challenge very well. I think I've done well. Well, we said it's more of an experiment, isn't it? I just want you guys to feel like you can wear this makeup or wear really glam makeup wherever you want. Like, the thing is, sometimes I feel makeup looks and then I go out to test and people stare at me and I'm like, I don't care. But I love wearing makeup like this and I feel really empowered wearing it and I'm like, do you know what? I've done a really good makeup look. I want to go out and show it. So I feel like I just want you guys to know that you can wear whatever makeup look you want to do. Like, You're going to have to do a video for your makeup, for your eyes. Love you. Yeah. I feel like everyone's so good at makeup that watches me. Like, wear whatever you want, even if you don't feel like you're makeup wear an experiment that's the beauty of makeup and that's the beauty of being ourselves like we can be whoever we want to be exactly i agree couldn't agree more so overall that was a success and i don't know about anyone else but i need to have snacks straight after eating so because there's not much i can get from nando's really with my stomach so i am going to go home and have more food i feel like we went there because it was good for the video and also spencer likes it there so we're gonna go get oh my makeup looks sick in that light oh my god it looked so good we need people to flash their lights anyway i've got these these are good eggs daisy and dome damn yeah, we love a mini egg. My God, we've just got in, right? What's happened, baby? I don't really know what happened. So we got out of the car. Yeah. Spencer's oh, crying. Mill slipped up. I, I slipped actually up. Cried. I showed I him. actually cried. He cried his eyes out. Wait there. Hold that for me, Angel, please. I am in agony. I slipped. Oh, have I got grazes? I've got grazes yeah. on my bum as well. Honestly, the thought of someone you love being hurt. Uh, honestly. I just I heard him run around Mills, Mills, and started crying. And that's the sweetest thing. You Like, you actually care that much. Yeah. I was more worried about you crying than I was in pain. I know. Just put a little bit of ginger cream on me. Yes, I will. And a massage. I love you so much. Oh my god, you're so. I love you. Look Sorry, at that's your eye makeup. Sorry, that's taken a bit of a turn. But oh my god, are you yeah. okay? Well, are you okay? I know. I've got great. I've got grays in my bum. Oh, oh I look yay! after you. Thank you. So, angels, we are home now. I'm still so happy with my eye makeup. Like, I really, really, really love it. Please, can you let me know if you like it down below? If you like makeup looks like this, or yeah, even if you don't, it's fine. I get it. But that is the end of the video. I am scratched and bruised now, apparently. But I really enjoyed doing this video, and I really 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 hope that you got the overall message from it i'm not just creating a youtube video i really want you to take something from this it's like my end goal for me to help you guys along with helping myself and i really think that we are so much stronger as a unit than we are on our own and if we can empower each other and help each other out then honestly this world would be such a nicer place i know that a lot of you can already do these things go out with full glam makeup looks go out with no makeup but there are a lot of people out there in the world that have a lot of insecurities and they struggle with anxiety and things like this seem so far away from what they can do but you can do it if you are one of those people watching you can do it go out with no makeup go on your own to a cinema go out for food on your own go with loads of makeup somewhere that you wouldn't necessarily think you could go there are people that are always going to judge you well i'm not setting out to try and change those people because judgmental people unfortunately they are quite hard to tackle but I really, really hope that we can help each other get a little bit more confident and a little bit stronger. And I think that we can live in this world a lot happier.
yeah anyway i love you guys so much please definitely give this video a massive thumbs up hit that subscribe button join my family of huns i'd be so 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 grateful i've got another exciting video coming on saturday and until next time i'm gonna love you and i'm gonna leave you okay so cute bye love this Ooh. Oh, not again emo